Hello, friends. This week's devotion is titled, Time for a Change. One of the ways God speaks to me is by giving me a revelatory nugget here and there, over time, that ultimately converges into a clarified message, a bigger picture of what he's doing. I think of it as trail mix on a treasure hunt that leads to a prize, the realization of his transforming and eternal love in my life and in others. Does he speak to you like this too? I believe one of his purposes in doing so is to prompt us to dig deeper in prayer and word for the fullness of his revelation, the unique and complete experience of a particular promise to us also to gently lead us into the manifestation of his new and higher place for us without overwhelming us, especially where ungodly strongholds have been intact for what feels like a long time. For months, God has been highlighting Wilson Phillips' song, Release Me. Then for weeks, he highlighted the folk pop hit, California Dreamin', written and recorded by John and Michelle Phillips, China Phillips' parents. China is the lead singer of Wilson Phillips. All the while, Holy Spirit was highlighting darkness to light scriptures, as well as messages about his anointing being hindered by adverse attitudes of the hearts. I soon began to realize he was showcasing something about the area of family, namely, that he is bringing change for the better, and that it is time to see the impossible manifest. God is answering prayers, especially concerning breakthrough restoration of our closest relationships. He is setting our souls free from toxic entanglements as we have intertwined ourselves increasingly with him. God is manifesting what he has been helping us work through all along and will see and experience the desires of our hearts in this area, more of his gift of love as seen in our closest relationships, even some of the ones God completely separated us from and others with whom we've had to set strong boundaries for a season. If there is someone in our lives we have forgiven and for whom we have prayed, someone we have resolved in our hearts as much as we feel we can, someone with whom we have been patient beyond what we thought we could, know that God is giving us increased breakthrough with this person and that we will surely see him do it. God is unshackling us from the mockery of prideful legalism into his lovely grace so that we can experience him in this power we've never known on this level in this area. God will reveal himself as our spirit of grace, who can and will do much to make up for past times as we continue to submit to him. Over time, as we have released hard-heartedness to God and have been made stronger in him and his ways, he has delivered us and is now manifesting divine health in our relationships by his transforming love. God is the only one who can cleanse hearts and reset these relationships. We need only to follow him. In so doing, we will see honor restored, respect for one another. As God has healed and matured us, we will come to know others in a new way. As past pain is swept away by our Lord, it will be replaced by his peace that surpasses understanding. No more will long-time festering wounds control these long-term relationships. Where God has been in the messy middle, we will witness him having worked it out well in the end for a new beginning. We will come into a new understanding with God and the others as we submit to his authority in stewarding these relationships his way. We will discover it was part of his plan all along. Love, which is ongoing and everlasting, will prove strong as God has aligned us to experience love's breakthrough and deep roots over time. Love will take us higher and broader over time 
as it now has freedom to grow in this area. It's time to celebrate these beautiful and timely changes. Yes, even in these beginning stages, for it is surely happening. We can praise God as he continues to complete the work in us and bring us together in a new and greater light. You have stayed the course. Now it's time to experience the manifest victory in this area. It's time to see and know the reflections of his creative transforming love, where he makes all things beautiful in their time. So pray with me if you will. Dear Lord, thank you for getting me to higher ground. Thank you that your unfailing love delivers me from cycles of defeat. You know all the intimate details of my relationships. You have been with me through it all. Thank you that you protected me, that pain is not my portion, and that you have now made a way for new beginnings. Thank you for restoring hope, confidence, and trust as I remained on the righteous path with you. Thank you for replacing roots of fear with your perfect love. Thank you for softened hearts and shifting cycles of unresolve into redemption. Thank you for helping me to rebound with honor. Thank you for giving me fresh vision and expressions of your love as I continue to run your race for me. Thank you for helping me to see others as you do and know you even more. Thank you for continuing to lead me into greater new beginnings in my relationships. For all this, I am grateful and look forward to moving on with them under your guidance. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.